All right, dude, uh, YouTube doing a quick video. Cache clock D. People report that the input detection does not work. Got a little MP3 USB player right here. 3.5 to RCA. RCA input is on. Nothing's on. No remote input is hooked up. You can look the pin out. Look up the pin out. There's nothing in there. No kit in the ignition. Door is open. Little sensor thing tripped. Go. Gotta press the play button on the MP3 player. Let's pause right now. You can see it click. Turns on. Pause it again. Turn it right off. There's a little off thing. With it turned off now. Press play again. You can see it turn on instantly. Pause again. Shuts off in a couple seconds. There you go. So anyone saying that the Cache Clock D input detection doesn't work and it does not turn off, well, they've got their stuff hooked up wrong. Was proving it right now that it works. Nice little device. This is my uh, my head unit right now. I got the crossover in the back. XM or uh, XCC 700 MP3 player. Don't even need a head unit.